War is not physics. Operations is not mathematics. It is an art, yet a science. When a predator hunts down its prey, combat is all about the Uda cycle. To observe, orientate, decide, and then act. The opponent with the faster Uda cycle will prevail. On that fateful day in December 1971, the Indian Air Force commander at Jaisalmer interpreted the call for help from the threatened army post at Longawala correctly. Observation He realized that the Pakistani T-59 tank regiment was in the middle of nowhere. The first observation aircraft brought him the perspective of the situation. The decision to launch hunters in an anti-armor role was almost immediate. When the hunters attacked the tanks, they noticed that their Aden gun was producing devastating results. The Pakistani tanks had strapped additional barrels of fuel atop their vehicles for refueling. The heavy 30mm caliber round set the tanks afire. It was immediately analyzed that gun attacks were the winning. The Indian Air Force strike aircraft strafed the floundering Pakistani tanks. The result is history. It was a victory. More accurately, it was annihilation. On 22nd February, a minute away from this scene of the Pakistani rout, Near the scenic town of Jaisalmer, the Indian Air Force will unsheath its iron fist. Over the past decade and a half, we've been building capabilities. We have linked people and platforms, sensors and shooters, all with decision-making aids. The offensive power that we can organize today is significant and control. We will defend our nation's freedom. Together, our armed forces will keep the peace and realize our national aim. We now have the ability to enable geographically dispersed forces to attain a high level of shared battle space awareness that is exploited to achieve strategic operational and tactical objectives in accordance with the commander's intent. Our sensors reach as deep. This increased speed and synchronization directly impacts operations across the battle space from support areas through combat zones. Network-centric warfare enhances the Indian Air Force's ability to combine into a seamless, joint warfighting force. It enables smaller composite strike packages that are more flexible and agile, but are able to wield greater combat power than before. Indian Air Force can today achieve an operational tempo and effectiveness with speed and precision that is perhaps brilliant. We will show you how the Indian Air Force of today is fully networked from sensors to the shooters.
Control Mission Commander UAV picking up hostile infiltration. Control UAV Commander launching strike mission. Mission 900 scrambles camp. Butcher rolling, rolling now. Butcher 1, you're clear to engage objective. Positive and target rolling in now. Butcher 2, clear to engage. Butcher 1, target destroyed. No and fuel request pigeons to tanker. One o'clock, thirty miles. Come see us at Pokhran.